Well, greetings from the sales floor of Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota, northern suburb of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Today we're going to talk about our latest car and it is so special. A 1985 Duesenberg II SJ Dual Cowl Phaeton. Oh my gosh, that's a mouthful and a half to say for a car, but I'll tell you what, we'll give you all the details in a moment. Well, greetings from the sales floor of Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota, a suburb, northern suburb of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Today, we've got one of the neatest cars we've had in an awful long time, a 1985 Duesenberg II SJ Dual Cowl Phaeton. Oh my goodness, what a spectacular car in every sense of the word. You know, some people will say that uh, these are kit cars or whatever. You know what, that's a far from the truth. This thing is a hand-built car. Everything on this car was done to the same specifications of a, a 19 early's, late early's, uh, 30's, 20's, real Duesenberg. They took the measurements right off of them. Now you're gonna wanna watch this entire video from start to finish because it's gonna have all the cold startup. We're gonna have the walk around, all that stuff as well. Now you can also click on the link in the description, take you right to our website and give you all the information on this car, the pricing structure, and you'll have access to all of our current inventory, which is close to 100 classic and collectible vehicles ranging from cars from the 1920s all the way up into the 70s and beyond. So if you're looking for a classic vehicle of any sort, odds are Ellingson Motor Cars probably has it in stock. Now our website is, if you want to look at everything, is www.ellingsonmotorcars.com. Very, very nice website, well put together. I think you'll very much enjoy looking at our current inventory. But for me, this is one of those cars. Everyone knows that the Duesenberg is by far the most iconic, most high-end, most desirable collectible car that was probably ever produced in the United States. Their timing was not the best, 1929, for the most part when they came out with the SJ models, give or take, and unfortunately, the depression was just setting in. And these cars, back in those days, would be selling from anywhere from anywhere from ten to twenty thousand dollars. The average guy in 1929 made 45 cents an hour. I mean the famous story I have is my wife's grandmother or grandfather worked at the Henry Ford plant over here in St. Paul and he said Henry was a tough guy to work for but at the end of the day at the end of the week gave you thirty dollars in cash and if you didn't like working for Henry there are 200 guys sitting outside the gate waiting for your job. So just one of those things. These cars were really special. Now this is what, you know, as I said, not really a, uh, a kit car. It is a exact replica of a real Duesenberg. And everything about it is spectacular. It was done in the highest uh, quality that you possibly can do. I mean, this car goes down the road really, really nice. Modern drivetrain, which really makes it special. 1985, it was came with a 351 Ford engine, a C6 automatic transmission. You got power steering, you got power front disc brakes. You have something that you can actually get in, put in gear, and drive away. And we, we actually took this car out on the road and it went 70 miles an hour without a flinch, needless to say. I just can't believe how well this car was put together. I was told that they would take almost 5,000 man hours to build each one of these cars, and they did only make 26 of this particular body style when they made these cars at Elite Heritage Motor uh, Cars in, over in Wisconsin but they got the headlights, everything is correct. Those are all done. They made molds of them, made castings, made everything to look just like a real one. So if you're standing 10 feet away from this car, you would almost think it was a brand new one. Now a real one, of course, is gonna be $1.5 million, give or take or more. So if you want one that gives you all the feelings, plus the modern conveniences of a late model car, we've got this right here. Beautiful color combination with the black, with the uh, supercharger uh, uh, things that come out for exhaust. They are just for looks. Like I said, this is a 351 regular fuel, a regular carburetor to engine, turn the key and it starts. 
Love the dual side mounts with the with the mirrors on the back with the with the leather straps that hold on both sides. As a matter of fact, I don't think we're going to be wanting to change tires too often on these cars. But you know, that's a one heck of a big tire. Really is beautiful with the wire wheels, the center caps that say you know Duesenberg two right on it. I mean, it is really got that look. I mean, that wide white. I don't think you can do much better. Can you imagine what this car was like in the 30s in the Depression? I mean, all the movie stars, Clark Gable, those kind of guys had these kind of cars. Now let's take a look at the inside on this car. As I said, with this body style, the dual windshields really is a, a really spectacular body style. Beautiful leather, red leather interior in this car. Absolutely spectacular. I mean, excellent, excellent condition all the way around. The instruments look just like what the real ones came with. I get the biggest kick out of it. The speedometer goes up to 160 miles an hour, and it even has an altimeter in there. So you can tell what altitude. That was something that they put in these cars back when they were new. Again, with power steering, automatic transmission, anybody can jump in this car and drive it. It's a big car. It would be a little challenging for uh, parallel parking, but uh, you know, needless to say, it would be a hoot. Uh, like I said, the, I look in here now and I can see it even has seat belts in place. So if you are concerned about that, it's really nice that it does have that. The back area, great leg room, it fits underneath here, has a very nice top. You got the boot on it here, canvas top, looks really nice. The thing is, I think if you own a car like this, you're probably driving it uh, on really, really nice days for the most part. Now, this car is actually a reinforced steel fiberglass fenders and, and body, and it uh, doesn't have any of those squeaks and creaks and everything. You know, many of us uh, in the old car world have seen some of these aftermarket cars that they put together. I'll tell you what, I drove this car and it is just absolutely awesome. I mean, it is solid, just goes down the road straight. And I mean, when you look out the hood, that original Duesenberg hood ornament, I mean, that's a mile and a half down there. That's a long ways away, but it is really gives you a feeling of class and prestige if that's what it is. Now you can find all of our stuff on Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram as well. We give us a like, leave us a comment, or subscribe. We appreciate that very much. Gives you all the information on this car, our current inventory, and as an added bonus, it has some of the information on cars we've sold in the past as well. So if you got time for perusing those sites, check them out. You'll find lots of interesting stuff right there on those sites. Yes, you know, in these days they didn't really have trunks per se, but you know, it's got the steamer type trunk on the back with the luggage rack and whatever, because that's what they did. People didn't, you know, you went to the hotels or you went to the places and you had a big trunk. That's where you kept all your stuff. Cause you know, there was no, no room in the inside if you were uh, running people going, riding in the car. But uh, yeah, steamer trunks is something very common to the cars of this era. No, it really has a great sound no matter what. It's just one of those really spectacular automobiles that, you know, try to find one. But they, they only made 26 of these and they're not for sale very often because it's kind of a sought after piece to say the least. Um, well, if you're like me, there's two reasons you want to come to Ellingson's. Number one, maybe you just want to come and look at all our beautiful inventory. We have lots and lots of neat cars in stock. Or number two, you got to come and look at this one in person because Trust me, you haven't seen one. It really is a spectacular automobile. And if you have any inclination that you want something like this, by golly, we've got a beauty right here on the sales floor of Ellingson's. Well, I'll tell you what, this has to be one of the most spectacular automobiles we've had on our inventory for a long time. It is spectacular in every sense of the word. Beautiful chrome paint, runs and drives. It is really one of those one of a kind, if you will. So, well, we appreciate you watching our videos. We thank you very much. You know, give us a call. We can be reached uh, Monday through Friday from 10 to 5 and Saturdays 10 to 4. If you want to talk to us about the car or you have other questions about anything, we're more than happy to help you uh, with getting a financing arranged, shipping. Give us a call, 763-428-7337. We're always ready to answer your questions. Thank you again, and we'll see you next time at www.ellingsonmotorcars.com.